uh, Link Team, uh, McCall, uh, Ford Observer, and just regular dude. Uh-huh. Uh, Gal Rail Sniper with uh, Multi-Spec Visor 2. Um, servant, Doc NG, uh, regular dude. Uh, the Pokemans on the on the sniper. <laughs> Pokemon. The, the the zero army. Just, uh, Choxa, zero. The Choxa yeah. with the HMG 360 oh, neurokinetics. Oh, is that zero? I know, oh, right? Uh, another link oh, team here. McCall, um, paramedic and regular dude. Uh huh. Oh. All right, Space Eight sniper. Yes. Uh, with the, his Pokemon. Uh. I can do the nice. Pokemon handler. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't forgot what their name is. <laughs> What's this? Uh, that's my later deployed model. Oh, yeah. no, no exist. No exist. No exist. <laughs> All right, we're playing Sith space, so we got consoles there, 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 and there. Okay, object is to dominate more quadrants. All right, so I've got my bodied hacker. I got a Janissary with HMG. Damn, he's got the names down, man. Total reaction <laughs> cricket bot. <laughs> with my Narun engineer, one Gulam, one Janissary, Gulam rifle, Gulam doctor. No, uh, that is a Napatan. And. <laughs> <laughs> I was like trying to get out of your way. <laughs> That's okay, they're all put together in tech. Uh, Damn it. She's a... <laughs> That's... Yeah. Really oh, that was That's um, that dude. That yeah, now I can't think of his name. <laughs> it's a Gulab doctor and a, a GMZ and sniper rifle. And yeah, cool. So, oh, and I got one camo marker. And you have turn, so are you going first or second? I will go second. Phew. <laughs> All right, what's up, guys? How I tick of you here, and that's right. We got a battle report. A battle report. <laughs> that's right. Playing some Infinity today. Uh, this is a practice list for a 300 point ITS that is coming up pretty soon. So I'm trying out my Hakuslam versus Kevin's Toha. And we're going to start off with the Jamzan. He's going to be my first activation. <clears throat> now, he's going to get in a sniper fight uh, with the Toha sniper, the guy with the viral. You just saw a quick zoom to him right there. Uh, I'm going to dump a ton of orders in here. This is kind of a bad omen here. Um, now, I'm banking my first two versus his one. Okay. Um, so I also have a slight uh, ballistic skill advantage, and I do manage to uh, down that sniper eventually. But the key is the key thing I should mention is that uh, I had to pour, I think, five or six orders. Now, I'm rocking two combat groups, I got one of ten, and then there's a small group of three. So almost 50% of my uh, my orders were spent just trying to take out one threat. Uh, now bear in mind he is holding down that side of the table uh, so it has to be done. Uh, in fact I, I canceled um, <clears throat> Kasim Beg his impetuous move because he was just gonna get uh, uh, sniped out there. Um, so that, that was key and although uh, my sniper did eventually win. It came at a pretty good cost. So there you see me moving Cossum Beg, and now I've got the Doctor. So I've got points in one of the quadrants, which is pretty good. And because the sniper's gone, I'm able to position the Doctor uh, behind one of these large buildings so that she can uh, run it and score on the last turn. Um, that to me was the challenge of this uh, scenario here is having first turn means that um, I'm gonna have to survive a turn of shooting trying to hold my quadrants and, and 
So frankly, I did not want to have first turn, but uh, Kevin quickly spotted that. Now here we go, I'm activating my Janissary with HMG. Uh, this was just a bonehead mistake here. Ran them out, um, figuring I got four, rocking four shots. I want to take out the other sniper, who's part of a, a link team. And then he had this other model, didn't know much about him. Turns out he has some kind of rule where he gets his full burst on arrows and his, like, it's kind of reverse. Like, on his active turn, he only gets burst one, but on his uh, reactive turn, he gets his full. Anyways, that means I'm at a, a burst disadvantage here where I thought I was going to be at uh, a burst advantage. So, I'm lucky to survive that first volley and actually do pop the symbiote armor off the sniper. But then I decide I gotta activate him again, get him in cover, but they're gonna get to shoot at him as he moves. So that's gonna be very tough, extremely tough. And, um, you know, um, it's, six, it's six shots versus my four, and you're gonna see that he is, in fact, unconscious. So, basically a huge loss on that side because uh, I have my, although I have my, um, total reaction HMG cricket bot he's in the other combat group so he only has one one uh, basically one order uh, or maybe three um, and I you saw me move my uh, Barid hacker just to get some points in that quadrant because I don't want um, at any time not to be dominating at least my side of the table so uh, and the hacker should be in a pretty good position next turn to actually uh, be next to one of the consoles so uh, that was a necessary move I wish I had more orders because I could have uh, ran him in a safer spot but um, it's not bad for now moving on to turn uh, Kevin's turn one he starts by revealing his ninja like right off the bat and he's right by my Jamzan sniper so we've got uh, some bad stuff about to happen here three Mine, I'm looking for eight teal camel minus six I'm looking for two <laughs> why is this ninja bullshit crit what <laughs> yeah. this doctor always kills shit man she always kills. <laughs> Hippocratic oath my ass. <laughs> <She's> like, <laughs> Killer doc. I need 14. Okay. Zombie rifle. Right. <laughs> You're bad. So one hit. Okay. Uh, so it's um. Damage 13. Damage 13. I have armor three, so I need 11. No. <laughs> He has regen. Oh, number damage here. And then you armor? No, it's crit. Oh, yeah. What? She just headshot at you. So you're unconscious, right? Or you don't have symbiote armor on her? Okay. Thank you. So there you go. A little bit of luck on my side as a Gulam doctor. Uh, was man I managed to crit the the infiltrating TO camoed ninja. Um, but you did see that the ninja did take out my Jamazan. Uh, so a bit of a trade there. Uh, here we go with uh, shots being fired at Custom Beg. He's gonna smoke dodge and he's gonna smoke dodge effectively. And it's going to block that entire corridor, which is pretty cool. Um, so a little bit of good news starting on Kevin's uh, first turn for me. Uh, I've got my guys protected on that side, and his his one of his major threats is out due to an impossible or a very unlikely uh, headshot from a doctor with a rifle. All right, so moving on. Um, that was K 
Kevin's turn one. And now on to my turn two as I start off with my uh, my Naron engineer, and he is going to be fixing my uh, total reaction uh, remote right there with the HMG. Um, so that's a successful uh, fix. However, Kevin, I don't know why it wasn't caught on film, has moved up a, a dual combi wielding guy and manages to get just the right angle and snipe out my my engineer so that's a tough break um next i'm moving my my uh akbar akbar doctor janissary who decides to throw some nimbus out there because there is still uh lots of danger with the uh hmg on the other side and the sniper uh now that's a nimbus grenade so it's not gonna um it's not gonna stop line of sight but uh, what it's gonna do is just uh, saturate the burst and put a modifier. I did not know that his sniper had um, MSV level 2 though. So that's going to be a tough one. Uh, he is going to luckily survive and take out the sniper. Uh, however, uh, I'm just out of orders and really what I wanted to do was get him up there and and uh, you know med the, the other Janissary. But I still, I still got to deal with that HMG and being turn two, I'm like, I gotta, I gotta get the specialist on the move somehow, and um, you know, just, just put points in the quadrants basically, and have specialists in the right position. Um, Kevin, Kevin's defensive game is uh, killing me here, as now I move what appears to be my uh Nafatan, but it is in fact uh hollow projector Havza with spitfire so he's going to reveal himself as he uh he he gets an arrow on him and i lose this firefight i lose this firefight and he's going unconscious so um this turn two is definitely it's definitely sucking pretty badly for me. So uh, there you see my move my Kulam Doctor. She's going to shoot uh, her med kit from abroad, and we're going to see how that works. Reason I'm using the uh, long range med kit is because there's just too much range on Kevin's side of the field. Do it again. Do all of the okay. harm. Any 11? Do all of the harm. Crit. Crit. So, Woo! Got a physical. Physical. Minus three because it's a mid. Oh god. Missiles are handy. Do all of the harm. Do <laughs> 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 Stay away from the light! Yes! Oh He's my up. god. <laughs> He's up. Damn you! So right now he's prone. He he like went to the edge and that was it. Okay. <laughs> Damn. That doctor. That doctor's MVP. Yes. <laughs> that doctor's MVP. <laughs> Holy hell. Alright, that's my turn. Okay. Figure out my borders. Uh, yeah. I, I need to see if I can find it. It's kind of cool. Uh, who are you activating? I will spend an order to move um, Pokemon Handler into a main group. Oh, Ash. Wait, is this the start of your turn? Yeah. I'm okay. still figuring. Does he have armor? I'm still figuring how many orders I have. He has heavy infantry, so I can't have it. Anything with HI under target. Okay, yeah. Sweet. So you're moving the... Actually, no, I can't. I do have 10 ready. Oh, okay. Nope. I did not need to do that. So I have 10 orders. So group one is still 10. Group two is two. Okay. So what are you doing? Group two is three. So moving on to uh, Kevin's shirt. He's got that. The guy I was telling you about with the dual uh, combi rifle. He's going to activate that guy. And 
Uh, he's going after the Barid Hacker. Um, <clears throat> so, Barid Hacker versus Dual Combi Guy. Uh, the Hacker is going to go down pretty quickly there. Uh, I do have one asterisk here that he actually, <laughs> at the beginning of the game, forgot to deploy that guy. And uh, so I did not know he was there. And um, I let him deploy because, you know, I'm a nice guy and I could always say, hey, you know, if I lose this <laughs> battle, I'll put an asterisk by it. But, uh, Anyways, uh, that's why the hacker, my breed hacker, was caught out in the open and then got shot up. Uh, moving on, you see Kevin moving his uh, link team, and they're going to be, uh, you know, getting into the, his quadrant there. Um, and because the eight, the uh, total reaction bot that was fixed. Uh, got downed again. Um, actually, let me take that back. I don't think the HMG uh, my total reaction HMG bot is not has not been down. He just doesn't have line of sight because uh, that's right. These fools are throwing smoke grenades everywhere. The zero V um, to shield them from my my total reaction bot, um, and they are. Well, what's really dangerous about this, not only can't I uh, cover their advance or, or take them out during their advance, um, they're getting dangerously close to my side. So he, he has a team holding back um, on his quadrant and then he's advancing this other link team on me. And that is just, uh, I'm being out, out uh, played here. Uh, it's basically what you're looking at. Uh, smoke grenades just... You know, I don't, I don't have an answer for that. I really... I really don't have an answer for Zero V. Um, other than... Um, I still have uh, a hacker. You can't see him, but he's sort of behind that building there. And uh, if they get close enough... Um, thinking maybe I can turn around and shotgun them if they if he makes a mistake during this 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 advance. Uh, really the only thing I have since he's taken out the Bari hacker so I have my Hawa hacker left. Oh it's kind of wishful thinking actually I was going to ask people in YouTube land if they know anything about the Hawa hacker because he doesn't come with anti-personal mines, as you can see. They're 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 going to use a intuitive attack and flame him. So I'm going to come out of cover and shotgun them. Um, but I'm going to to uh, I think I take down the leader in in this exchange. Uh, but I also I fail the the fire check this is burst two heavy flamer i mean that, that's pretty nasty up close not much i can do about that um but i did at least down the link leader and that should break the link i don't know much about the toha but i figure you, you can't have a link team of two um and also the fire managed to um to hit my guy with the spitfire so Spitfire guy did actually react as well as the hacker, and uh, just unfortunate rolling. Uh, I was only uh, able to down one guy, and then I think what he did was he, he used an order to med med up the guys, and then I don't know if he if this is legal or not, but he used the command point to turn them back into a link team. If that is incorrect, someone put it in the comments because, I, again, I, I don't know the Toha uh, Link Team rules. Never play them. Um, seems seems legit to me, though. You can use command tokens to uh, to you know make them a command. I think you could do that. You know, regardless if they're a Link Team or not, just say okay, 
uh, maybe do it via uh, combined order. Maybe that's the way to go. Anyways, um, that's them flaming my 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 other Janissary. So that's more bad news. And so what happens there is that they ang he angles the flamer so it, it gets the uh, my total reaction bot as well and burns them. And then here we are in my final turn. Uh, not much I could do. I mean, I've pretty much just kind of he, he's kind of he's bled me his his previous turn oh no no we're still in his turn oh no that's an arrow <laughs> he arrows me with double flamer and kills my lieutenant and the other janissary so that's how I started my final turn so um you can tell okay so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna win this one uh Toha is gonna take it with a decisive uh, turn where he just he basically won that side of the table um, despite having the majority of my points on that side um, and here I am um, just desperate to get some points on just anything uh, I can't get my classified because that was uh, sabotage and I lost both the Naren engineer and the Hawa hacker so um, there's no D charges left in my army to to take out the building uh, so best I could do is get uh, custom bag up on the other side and, and get a quadrant away from Kevin you know um, still have to deal with that that HMG guy as he jumps he jumps back on the bike um, and I'm gonna round the corner I'm gonna try and Panzerfaust that guy to death and try to score at the same time and so as I cross the that little alleyway there um, he's gonna declare his his arrow and I'm gonna shoot my pan uh, Panzerfaust and you know, burst four versus burst one. Odds weren't really in my favor there. Um, and I do end up taking hits. I have to be dogged because I, I still have some points left. And I've shifted all the guys into one command group. And I'm like, you know what? I'm, I'm going to go and use my other shot. And and take you take just do as much damage as possible. I mean, I lost the game. But I'm, at this point, I'm just going to have fun and just try to kill stuff um yeah tough tough loss for me on this one uh learned a lot about you know what I, you know i have to plan uh, if i'm going to take a deployment away i better plan for turn i think on this one i won the lieutenant role i should have just taken turn and and took second the exact thing that kevin did and i think i would have fared better uh anyways that is my battle report it's been a long time guys so this is an extra long one hope you enjoyed it and i will see you on the next video